everybody, it is Alice. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Boxing Day sales haul video for you because like on Boxing Day I went shopping in the sales and it was so busy, can I just say. This year I went to Edinburgh and we stayed in our apartment over Christmas. It was so lovely and we just had like a nice relaxing time and obviously we went to the shops in Edinburgh and like you could hardly move in any of the shops. Like it was packed compared to where like I live because the place where I live is, is a lot smaller and it's, it's a lot quieter and you can actually like walk around everywhere but the shops are so busy so this year I probably haven't bought as much as I have last year like in all the clothes shops the fitting rooms were all sh like closed so I couldn't even try on clothes because I was after like some new jeans and everything but I couldn't so that's, that's why I don't have any clothes as such in this haul just because they weren't able to try them on and obviously like, I didn't want to buy some clothes and then have to return them because that is just so much effort and I can't be bothered with that. Now I'll stop rambling so let's go on the video. So the first shop I went into was New Look as you can see from the bag um, and like every year like I go into New Look because they have some really good sales on. Wow it's so bright outside oh my god. <laughs> but anyway like New Look have like really good sales on like the clothes are really good prices and everything and I need to have, have a look at a few of the clothes but as I said before the fitting rooms weren't open so I wasn't able to try anything on however I had a look in the jewellery section because remember I think it was last year I got like, like some nice like rings and jewellery so this time I went to have a look at the jewellery and I got um one of their necklaces basically like, like a three piece one um and this is just in gold i don't know if it'll show up on here i will do a close-up it's just like a like a three piece one where it's all connected and this was only i think it was only it was only two pound fifty which i was like shocked because like it was meant to be six ninety nine so two pound fifty for this is really nice and it is really pretty like just so really pretty and really cute so i can't believe i got this in your look um uh, I will be wearing this a lot because it is really really lovely. Next I went into Debenhams and I like never buy anything in Debenhams like it is like rare if I buy anything from there. However I went to the Urban Decay stand um, and I bought the, the Troublemaker mascara. This was 13 to 65 and I was actually after a new mascara so I was like I'm gonna get it because Urban Decay is a really good brand. I have got one of their naked smoky palettes but like apart from that I don't have anything else from their brand however it is cruelty free and I was like I'll get it because like everyone loves Urban Decay so I was like I'm just gonna go straight in my basket and then I also got their Kirsten Leanne highlight palette I think it's highlight yeah highlight palette it's just 1540 and it's just like a beautiful little highlight palette I might actually open it for you guys I've not actually opened this last one of these because there's a Kirsten Leanne um, I should have had as well, there's only one left of these, so I was like, I'm going to get this. Um, oh, this is very nice, it's just like the three different highlight shades. It's got like a dark one, like a whiter one, and then kind of like a brown colour. That is so pretty, and it also comes in like a little mirror as well, I can't wait to use this. Um, so, I can't, honestly, I think, uh, Urban Decay is meant to be really good, so I can't wait to use these. Next, I went into Lush, and I bought the Magic Wand a bubble bar this is like the one with like the little star on the stick i'm actually opening it for you guys um because like i kept it in my handbag and now my handbag smells of it like it smells incredible and this was only 345 um so it's like half price which is really good and the lush have really good sales on like they've got sales on most of like the christmas products and honestly it's so worth it like the products are so good Hopefully it hasn't broken, I don't think it has. So this is just like a little pink star with the little bell, it's like sparkly. So cute, I, I don't want to break it by shaking it but as you can tell it's really cute and I can't use it in my bath and yeah I'm just, I'm just super happy with this. I could literally smell this all day because it smells so nice like <laughs> but yeah. I am happy that I got this. Next, I went into Primark and I only bought one thing and I bought these like kind of like fluffy PJ bottoms and there's like a white like, kind of fluffy colour and these were only £2 reduced from £5 and um, I bought these just because like I do lounge in the house a lot and obviously I don't want to wear jeans like indoors because like that's so uncomfortable so I got these and they're honestly so fluffy and I had them in blue, grey, pink and white and obviously I got the white ones because that was the only size that I had left in in this colour um, so I got these and £2 it's really good and like, I, I'll literally be wearing these all the time because they are super soft. So 
so yes i went into boots and uh, in twice actually the first time i went in and i only looked also for glow stuff stuff because i didn't realize that i had like more makeup stuff but then the second time i had like a proper look around and i did find some really nice stuff so the first thing which i got it was this soap and glory naughty but spice duo this is only 250 because like obviously like all of like the christmas stuff and boots uh, it's like half price. This is only two fifty, and this, and this is like the, the limited edition um, Christmas kind of scent. And um, I bought the bigger set for my mum for Christmas, and it honestly smells divine. So I can't wait to use this, and it's super cute. And even though I did get four soap and glory sets for Christmas, I couldn't resist. Two fifty for this. It's really good. Um, so yeah, so you definitely need to have a look in boots if you haven't already because. They have got so much Christmas stuff, it's unbelievable, and honestly, half price for it is just really good, so, yeah, and it smells really nice as well. And then I also bought another Sofa Glory set, this is only £5, and this, this comes with, like, the Sugar Crush scent, it's so, like the spray, the body wash, hand food, the body butter, and also the eye patch, and I have used these eye patches before, and they're really good, like, if, you, like, if you've got really bad dark circles, so I can't wait to use this, and... The packaging's really good as well, so I'm happy that I got this and I can't wait to use this. And the final thing that I got in boots, I was not expecting to get, but it is this five pack of Spectrum, I can't even speak today, Spectrum brushes. So and this is like the mermaid set, so it comes with like an eyeshadow brush. I'm not going to read actually. What, what brushes does it come with? So we have the foundation brush, which is AO3, comes with the blusher brush, which is AO5, then the highlight brush A10, and then the BO4 for eyeshadow, and then AO1 for powder. So, as you can tell, it's got a lovely range of different brushes in here. And obviously, it comes in like a little cute mermaid makeup bag. I think it's like a little shell, I think. It's really cute, and the packaging is really nice as well. And I've seen this, I was like, is this actually like real? Because these brushes are very expensive. Um, this was only £15 for like. Fifteen pounds for this, and these brushes are cruelty free. So, so like I say, they won't be killing animals to make these brushes, which is really good because I am against animal cruelty. Like it's so cruel. So, how to use these? And it's meant to be really good because my sister got the Mean Girls set, and they look really good as well. So, yeah, very happy with this purchase. Finally, I went into IKEA. But obviously, like IKEA only have a sale on more, like more on like the Christmas things. But like these two things weren't in the sale. But I wanted to add them in the video because I felt like the video would be really short otherwise. Succulent, how how worth here? That's what it says on like the tag. Um, it basically has like three succulents in it, and it's in like a lovely little pink pot. And I bought this because it's very cute, and I love succulents. And obviously this is pink and I think I remember I've been in Ikea a few times and I've seen this and be, I've been like oh my god I want this however I had just haven't bought it because it's £9 and £9 isn't too bad for it but like I used to find that like expensive because I didn't have a job back in the day but now, but now I've got it I'm super happy with it and I don't know where I'm going to put it I might put it in the background of here because I was going to put it on my shelf however my shelf is quite like weak, like the walls are quite like weak, so I think this might weigh it down because it is quite heavy. So I was maybe thinking, put it somewhere. I'm, I'm not sure yet, but I am going to have it in, in the background of this video because I am going to change the background up a little bit. So yeah, I'm super happy with this. Um, and yeah. Also from IKEA, I bought this lovely rug. It was only ten pounds. It's just like a. It is fake fur, by the way. It's just like a. It's kind of like a creamy white rug, and this is the tough. Lund rug in case you're wondering it's only £10 and I bought this because I like I have always eyed these up in high high key but I've never bought them just because I just haven't and but it's really nice £10 that, that went straight in my basket so yeah so guys this is the end of my video Um, I did get a lot of lovely things this year and also let me know if you went in, in sales and what you bought because I'm sure you guys have got a lot of lovely things and anyway I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to leave a thumbs up in the comment down below and please subscribe if, if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video bye <laughs>